Hi Rustlers, welcome to my channel. In this video I'm going to be showing you how to make these festive wire creations. So you've got a gingerbread one, and a reindeer one, and a cute little boot or a stocking. Because it's coming up to that time of year again where you are going to be doing Christmassy crafts, or like that, Christmassy crafts. So, Christmassy crafts with okay, Kate, that's a mouthful. So, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to make them fabulous creation. As you know, I make wire sculptures all the time, so I thought it'd be a cool idea to show you guys. I mean, it's not, it is a bit technical, and it does take a little bit of time to do. I'm not going to go through the whole process, otherwise, I'll be here forever, and I don't think you'd want to be staying here watching me doing that the whole way through. So, I'm going to show you just some cool tips or ways to do it and then you can get crafty and creative on your own. So basically I got some templates from online. So these are the templates here. As you can see there's gingerbread man, stocking, snowman and a Christmas tree. Whenever I'm doing my templates I always get a bunch of templates and then try it out and see what works and what doesn't because everything's not going to work in the art world as you know and as I always say some things work some things just go wrong um so yeah with this I of course went around the mainframe of the gingerbread first when going around the outside to use template I use these fabulous cutters I got them from Christmas they're a really good find actually they're only like a pound something and they're really cool they've got long rounded nose so you can bend easily around the metal gingerbread man or person as you want to say hang on a sec you can't see him properly I don't know, maybe so there you go so you go around the main frame with a bit more thicker wire so with this i use I've got my clamp here as well. I use the clamp to hold it into place. So you start off with going around the main frame with some thicker wire so it's nice and thick wire. You can get this from garden centres or online. So you give it a base kind of frame to start with. There you go. So you can see the main frame and then I make it look a bit more pretty you can use different colours I have got greens and blues and reds that I might try out later on different designs but for this one I just used thinner wire and wrapped it around the thicker wire as you can see I think it gives it a cute little design you can hang it onto Christmas trees or you can hang anywhere just to look cool and the same goes for a little booty, a little stocking and a cute little reindeer. Do exactly the same as the went around the frame, as you can see. Then I went around again with the smaller wire to give it a cute little effect. As you can see. And you can put fishing wire onto the wire creation to make it look like it's kind of hovering like I say you can hang it on to Christmas tree these little festive fabulous creations here you can hang them onto Christmas tree or you can hang them over the fire oh not fireplace because they're wire and they'll get hot yeah that's the main thing make sure they're not near a fireplace because they are wire at the end of the day and they will get warm so you don't want to be doing that you can hang them on a Christmas tree or you can hang them on a ceiling or you could like make a little mobile like I did with my Halloween wire ghosts and bats you could do exactly the same as with that you could hang them onto a little mobile and make a Christmassy little mobile that'd be quite cute but I thought that a cute little idea just to get crafty with and I might show you later on some of my other designs I'm going to be doing with my wire creations, Christmas crafty creations with Kate. So I'm going to be doing some festive fabulous fun with my other wire creations and I'll keep you informed of what I'm doing. If you like these do give a thumbs up in this video and let me know and if there's any other tips you think I could do 
these creations or how I could display them then let me know as well. I was thinking you could even have like a frame around it like a photo frame, a white frame and then put it in the middle and have like three in a row that look quite cute I think just to like display them. I think they're little cute little art pieces as well as being fabulous ornaments festive ornaments, fabulous festive ornaments yeah so that's my little cute little designs I hope you like them and give them a try and if you do give them a try do put in the comment box below and do a video of you making them it would be cool to see what kind of thing you can make to make them out of twigs maybe even as well and I'll keep you updated on any festive fabulous videos I'll make and keep crafty and creative at Christmas and see you guys later